welcome to the Rare Fishing Channel. Today we will share information about around the sea world. Let's explore the sea. Tiger Barb. The tiger barb or Sumatra barb is a species of tropical cyprinid fish. The natural geographic range reportedly extends throughout the Malay Peninsula, Sumatra and Borneo in Indonesia, with unsubstantiated sightings reported in Cambodia. Tiger barbs are also found in many other parts of Asia, and with little reliable collection data over long periods of time. Tiger barbs may sometimes be confused with Puntigris anchis porus, Puntigris navejotso dii, or Puntigris parti pentazona, which are similar in appearance. Description The tiger barb can grow to about 7 to 10 cm long and 3 to 4 cm wide, although they are often smaller when kept in captivity. Native fish are silver to brownish yellow with four black stripes and red fins. The green tiger barb is the same size and has the same nature as the normal barb, but has a green body. The green tiger barb, often called the moss green tiger barb, can vary considerably in how green it looks. Albino barbs are a light yellow with four barely visible stripes. Habitat Tiger barbs have been reported to be found in clear or turbid shallow waters of moderately flowing streams. They live in Indonesia, Borneo, tropical climates and prefer water with a 6.0 to 8.0 pH, a water hardness of 5 to 19 dGH, and a temperature range of 77 to 82 degrees Fahrenheit or 25 to 27.8 degrees Celsius. Their discovery in swamp lakes subject to great changes in water level suggests a wide tolerance to water quality fluctuations. Their average lifespan is 7 years. When exposed to decreased temperature levels, the tiger barb fish experiences a change in body color. The male fish tend to display a bright red color in the dorsal fin, ventral fin, caudal fin, and snout. When the water temperature drops to 21 degrees Celsius, both the male and the female fish were observed to have a decayed body color. When the temperature decreases even further to 19 degrees Celsius, their distinct stripes even appear to be dimmed. How to keep tiger barbs? Tiger barbs are great additions to most tanks and are easy to care for. They are a beautiful freshwater fish, with a yellow, orange, gold or red background and black stripes. Although they are semi-aggressive, they make good community fish and enjoy swimming in a school. Provide a large tank and keep tiger barbs together in groups of six or more. Creating the right environment One, get six or more tiger barbs 
they will become more aggressive to tank mates if you have a group of less than 6. 2. Choose a large aquarium. A 20-gallon aquarium, 75 liters, is the minimum size for 6 tiger barbs. The larger the aquarium, the better, as tiger barbs enjoy open space to swim around in. Three. Put substrate on the bottom of the tank. A fine gravel or sandy substrate is ideal for tiger barbs. You can also add larger rocks to the tank to mimic their native habitat. 4. Add a heater. Since tiger barbs are tropical fish they should be kept in an aquarium with a temperature between 21 to 26 degrees Celsius. Install a tank heater to keep the temperature at a constant and comfortable level for your fish. 5. Install a filter. All aquariums require a filter, as decomposing organic matter, nitrates, and phosphates build up over time. Install a filter to ensure you have enough oxygen as well as clean water for your fish. 6. Provide hiding places for your fish. Driftwood makes excellent hiding places for tiger barbs, as do plants. Anubias and Javan fern are good plant choices for tiger barbs, but should be kept to the side of the tank to provide open space for swimming. To keep the driftwood from discoloring the water in your aquarium, submerge it a separate container of water for one to two weeks before placing it in the tank. 7. Acclimate the tiger barbs to the aquarium. Acclimation is a process which all fish need to go through. Acclimation helps the fish adapt to the aquarium water parameters without shocking their systems. Tilda float the bag of tiger barbs in the tank for at least 15 minutes to allow the fish to adjust to the temperature. Tilda cut open the bag just under the metal clip or not and roll the top edge of the bag down one inch. This will create an air pocket within the lip of the bag and enable the bag to float on the surface of the water. Tilda add half cup, 118 milliliters, of aquarium water to the bag. Tilda repeat this step every 4 minutes until the shipping bag is full. Tilda use a net to remove the fish from the bag and release them into the aquarium. Tilda remove the filled shipping bag from the aquarium and discard the water. Caring for Tiger Barbs 1. Choose tank mates wisely. Tiger barbs are aggressive fish and are very notorious fin nippers. Bottom dwellers or larger fish such as mollies, bala sharks and parrot cichlids, are likely to be successful in the same aquarium as tiger barbs. 2. Quarantine injured tank mates. Tiger barbs are likely to attack wounded fish to exert their dominance. 
3. Feed your tiger barbs a mixed diet. Tiger barbs are omnivores, meaning they eat both animal and plant life. 4. Replace 25 to 50 percent of the tank water with fresh water once a month. This will provide oxygen as well as remove nitrates and phosphates from the water. 5. Monitor the pH levels. For tiger barbs, the pH level of the water in the tank needs to stay between 6.0 and 7.0. 6. Breed tiger barbs in a separate tank. If you have several tiger barbs, they will pair up naturally. However, they do eat their own eggs, as well as the eggs of other fish, so it's best to set up a separate tank for breeding. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe this channel. See you later!